College Station family is saying goodbye to a historic home today. George and Hillary Jessup live in the home that once belonged to General James Earl Rutter, the 16th president of Texas A&M University. KAG's HD News reporter Tashar Parker shows us how the nearly 80-year-old home is sharing bits and pieces of history with the residents of College Station. This isn't just any garage sale. It's been in our family almost half a century. Instead of simply salvaging old household goods before the Jessup family moves to Utah, they are selling a bit of Texas A&M history. So this is known as a Rudder home because the home on campus is known as a president. Built in 1936 with its white pillars and neoclassical style, it once belonged to the 16th president of Texas A&M University, General James Earl Rudder. Uh, they moved his family over here when the, the, the president's home on campus burned. And until recently, the home belonged to George and Hillary Jessup. But after more than a decade at the historic residence, they are packing their bags for Utah and selling 80% of their belongings. We're downsizing and we just can't have decorative things. Everything we have now has to be utilitarian. <laughs> While there were many rooms for sale, there was one specific room blocked off. Hillary tells us significance of what's behind that white wall. This room is our, we call it the library room. My father was Cliff May, and he collected these books many, many years ago. By many years ago, she means centuries. Some of the books date back to the 1500s. Her father, Cliff May, is known as the father of the California Ranch House. The books he collected used to guide the Padres, or priests of Spain, with their sermons. He had them in, our, in his house, and it was floor-to-ceiling books. And when my dad died, we um, inherited the books. But for now, the books are one of the only things sticking around, as George and Hillary... Park City Mountain is open for skiing. Another day in paradise. ...are preparing to leave history behind and make Park City, Utah, their new home. Tashar Parker, KX HD News. Amazing history there. Well, there were rumors the home would be turned into a bed and breakfast. But we're told the Aggie family who bought the home will keep it as a family residence.